This year, the submissions for our Innovation Awards were very, very high quality. Um, we had two distinct industry groupings. We had some automotive submissions and we had some aerospace and defence submissions. Um, both of which, both groups showed you know, uh, the technology that we have to offer being used in very, very innovative ways by these companies to address the challenges of complexity. That's complexity coming from globalization, complexity coming from regulation, complexity coming from increased customer requirements, uh, complexity working with a, with a very diverse supply chain. And each of the solutions that we saw on stage demonstrated a unique and innovative way in which these companies have successfully become masters of the complexity which is giving them a competitive advantage in their, in their marketplace. We don't get fooled again. This year we've evolved the judging criteria that we use in the Innovation Award. In previous years we've had a panel of judges which I chair which came to the, the decision about who was the winner, the, the second and first runner-up. Uh, this year we took a different approach. Um, we offered 40% of the points to uh, our, an external third-party SIM data. And Peter Bellello, who is the president of SIM data, reviewed the submissions and gave his opinion on, on the quality of them and also allocated points. I mean, Peter actually made some very interesting points that the quality of the submissions he saw and the innovation in the use of PLM in Asia Pacific equaled, if not surpassed, other types of solutions that he's now seeing in, in uh, Europe and in North America. So it's a very good indication of the increasing maturity of the solutions we, our customers are putting in place in Asia Pacific. So 40% went to SIM data. Another 40% went to Siemens PLM, and myself as the head of the Siemens PLM judging panel, I represented 40% of the points. And then the final 20% of the points went to the audience. And so the customers in the Asia Pacific Executive Conference, they voted using a handheld voting machine on the submission which they best felt reflected innovation. And the combination of SIM data, Siemens PLM and the audience was then used to, to select our eventual winner.